Welcome to today's Tune In Tuesday webcast series hosted by your very own BDMs. Thank you for taking the time out of your busy day to join us for today's first ever Wellness at Sea webinar. I'm Calvin Rodriguez, Mr. 305 representing South Florida and the Caribbean Islands. I'm joined by my very good friend and colleague, Maria Cobb, representing Louisiana, Mississippi, and Alabama. Today's topic is one that I hold near and dear to my heart. So ladies and gentlemen, make sure you have those sneakers ready. As Calvin said, my name is Maria Cobb, and I am coming to you live today from my hometown of Baton Rouge, Louisiana. Now, I would much rather be on a carnival cruise right now in our beautiful Cloud Nine Spa, but I'm so excited to be here with you today with Calvin and all of you fabulous travel advisors to talk about wellness at sea on carnival. So here at Carnival, you know, we're all about the fun, right? We talk about fun on every occasion that we get. We also talk a lot about food. I know that I do. But fitness? We don't talk about fitness too much. So we just wanted to share some, uh, some tips and some tricks on how you can focus on maintaining mind-body wellness while cruising with us on Carnival. So uh, we'll be talking through that a little bit with our Cloud9 Spa. And then Calvin and I will discuss some healthy food options as well when you're sailing with us. Can't forget about all those delicious options. And then some other fun ways that Calvin and I personally like to uh, remain active and focus on our mind body wellness when we're cruising on Carnival as well. So with that said, I am going to be leaving most of the fitness tips up to my friend Calvin Rodriguez, because honestly, at this point, my idea of an intense workout is chasing a toddler around the living room or dancing to the wiggles. So we're going to get started with Calvin today as he joins us in the gym. So we're ready to pump you up. Over to you, Calvin. Hey, thanks, Maria. I truly appreciate it. Let me tell you, ladies and gentlemen, are you guys ready to stay fit at sea? Get your clients excited about all the fun and fitness that we have on board our ships. And let me tell you, I went to the gym this morning. I would have rather gone be on the ship uh, at the gym, but uh, I got my workout this morning. And let me tell you something. Uh, in our fitness center, uh, we have so... Uh, many options for all your clients. Uh, we have state-of-the-art life fitness equipment, uh, you know, from uh, ellipticals to treadmills to bicycles. And if your clients are looking for free weights, uh, we have all different uh, sizes uh, or weights uh, uh, with dumbbells and we have benches as well. So that way they can work out uh, during the morning, day or late afternoon, wherever they feel uh, is best for them to be able to work out in our fitness center. But we just don't have weights here. We also have specialty classes that we offer from our personal trainers on board. Uh, not only is it about fitness, wellness, beauty seminars, but also you can take a class on how to uh, better work out those abs, uh, maybe a uh, eat a little bit healthier, but not only do we have those classes, we also offer yoga, Pilates. And for those of you that are into cycling, boy, we have that as well. Obviously there is a fee that's involved with these uh, extra classes uh, that we offer, but with Carnival, we are very flexible when it comes to that. Now, there are some classes that you can take advantage of with our spa staterooms that Maria will get into later on in the presentation. But the other thing I want to mention is that our, if, you're, if your clients are really into cycling, uh, we do have cycling available with state-of-the-art equipment uh, in our Vista class ships and Excel ships, which is uh, Vista, Horizon, and Panorama, and our new flagship Mardi Gras, 
and her sister coming in 2022, uh, Carnival Celebration, very excited about her. But if you're looking for some outdoor adventure, you're not a gym rat, you don't wanna be indoors, well, hey, we have our sports square area, which is available for your clients to be able to take advantage of the outdoors, take on those beautiful scenic views of the ocean while sailing out to the next port of call. But uh, not only with Sports Square, when we get started here is some of the features that we do offer is our jogging track. And let me tell you, who thought of having a jogging track on board the ship? Well, we have one and it's a lot of fun because like I mentioned, while you're running, you can look at all these beautiful views uh, or if you're walking. Now, the cool thing about our tracks is they are padded so that way they're easier on your knees for those long distance runs. And a quick fact, so you know, or did you know, is that if on most of our ships, if you go seven laps around, uh, it's one mile, and on other ships is 10 laps for that one mile. So pretty cool to know this little facts, but it doesn't stop here in the jogging track. We also have Sky Fitness. What? A fitness outdoors? Yes, yes, we do. And these Sky Fitnesses are available on our Carnival Breeze Magic Vista class, which again is our Vista Horizon and Panorama Carnival Sunshine and our XL class, which include Mardi Gras and coming soon Carnival Celebration. Now, I love working out in the outdoors. Uh, it gives you something different to do. Uh, but the great thing about our Sky Fitness is that we have punching bags, we have weight, weighted training machines available. I also like the pull-up bar and the dips uh, that we also have, but uh, we have stationary bikes and ellipticals. So you get a full body workout outdoors in our Sky Fitness. But if your clients are not into our Sky Fitness or maybe our fitness center, well, hey, we have a lot of fun in our sports square area. And let me go over just a few of those uh, areas that we have. We have our miniature golf. Yes, this is a sport and it is very challenging putting in that ball in the hole. So this is a lot of fun, not only uh, physically, but you know, family can get involved, the kids and everyone can have such a great time. But you can also take your talents to ping pong table and move side to side and work out with uh, a friendly competition with a friendly uh, a, a family member maybe just another guest on board the ship uh, and really uh, take some action in ping pong but did you know we have a volleyball court uh, on the ship yes you can play volleyball while at sea and work out but it's also located in the same area as our basketball courts. So, hey, if you want to play a game of horse or maybe a one-on-one, -on -one, this is a great activity uh, to stay fit and do a lot of cardio while you're up there. But if your clients are not into any of these uh, four, well, maybe they want to take the challenge of ropes course. Wow, this is, let me tell you, this takes it here. This is all mind and body when it comes to ropes course because your adrenaline starts rushing because as soon as you get up there and you look down, you're freaking out. And so you really want to get through this course as quick as possible. So, but it is a lot of fun. It does work out the full body. And who knew we would have a bicycle on the top deck of our ship and that's sky ride. Think about all the fun you have riding around the entire towards the back shift towards the middle of Lido, riding up on Sky Ride, working out those legs on a bicycle. That's pretty amazing. So these are all great options for your clients to be able to stay active while they're taking their vacation on Carnival Cruise Line. You know, Calvin, I feel like I just worked out just hearing about all those ways to stay active on board. You know, I have to say that those cycling classes are really fun. Out of everything that you talked about, those are probably my favorite. 
you know, our instructors, they're high energy, the music that they choose for the classes is great. Now it's been a long time since I've taken one of our cycle classes, I've got to admit, um, you know, it has definitely been a while. But on my last couple of cruises, I've really enjoyed doing laps around the sports track, because as you said, I mean, there's nothing like that beautiful view when you're up there. Um, but you know what I do do on every single cruise? I enjoy our pools and our hot tubs. You know, after I've worked out, whether I've gone up to the sports track or if I've done a cycling class, I always like to wind down with a dip in one of our hot tubs, maybe a dip in the pool. Now, keep in mind, our pools are also a great place to get some exercise in. You know, you can tread water, you can do a few very short laps back and forth, maybe try the aft pool because there's usually less people back there, or maybe even some jumping jacks or some leg raises, everyone. These are all Calvin's suggestions when it comes to um, some exercises you can do in the pool or in a hot tub. And I think that they're all great. Now I've got to admit, I have never done any of these exercises while in a pool. Uh, my pool experience on Carnival, just to let you all know, usually involves a deck chair and a healthy pineapple coconut smoothie, maybe with a little bit of rum in it, Maybe most people would call this a pina colada, but it's all good. I do love using our hot tubs to soak away any stress and to, um, you know, ease away any tension that I've had from walking along the sports track. So now that we've talked a little bit about staying active on board the ship, Calvin is going to talk through some ways to stay active when you're off the ship in our beautiful ports of call. Let me tell you, Maria. You know, I knew it. I knew that you wanted to spike your pina colada just so you could get <laughs> that extra energy. Yes. To work out around the top deck of our ship. So that's pretty amazing. Ladies and gentlemen, let me tell you, when your clients are looking for short excursions, yes, we are known for our short excursions. And if they're looking for an active lifestyle off the ship, we have so many options available for your clients. And these are just a few here that I have in front of me that I'll go over with you all. But when you think about swimming, uh, this is a really great sport. If, if they're at uh, one of the ports where there's a pool available or um, on the beach, you know, swimming is a great activity for them. Snorkeling as well. If one of our uh, ports uh, offers hiking, this is an amazing uh, cardio exercise, leg exercise as well, biking, going around the ports and uh, being able to take on the views while you're doing some exercising. But you can't forget about kayaking and working out those arms and back. Uh, great activity uh, to keep active. And in our Half Moon Key, we also have horseback riding. Yes, this is pretty amazing to uh, go horseback riding in our beautiful waters of Half Moon Key. A really great opportunity for your clients. But if your clients just want to walk on the sand or even run on the beach, hey, that is a great exercise. And trust me, I took my talents to South Beach. And let me tell you, those runs on the sand are not easy and they do work you out. But we also have zip lining. And for those excursions that offer surfing, this is another great opportunity and your clients could take care, uh, take uh, some surfing lessons right in our private island of Grand Turk with our flow rider. So if they've never surfed before, well, they could sure give it a try in our flow rider at Grand Turk. So these are great, great options for your clients to stay active while at one of our ports of call. I love it, Calvin. Those are all such great suggestions. I've got to say, I am a little bit too chicken for the zip lining, but one of my favorite active uh, shore excursions is definitely snorkeling. And I'm always pretty impressed at how much my arms are sore the next day after snorkeling. So it is certainly one of my favorite ways to work out because it's kind of like an undercover workout, which are my favorite workouts. So now that we've talked about ways to remain active while you're cruising, I want to share with all of you a little bit about our onboard retreat for mind-body wellness. So, you know, contrary to popular belief, 
I'm not a personal trainer. I'm not a fitness instructor or dietitian, but I would consider myself a spa connoisseur, especially when it comes to the spas on board our ships. So when we talk about mind body wellness, it really is all about the balance, balancing activity and balancing proper rest. So that is where our spas come into play in order to get you refreshed and rejuvenated, especially after an active day. Now, why is mind body wellness even important? Why should we focus on it? Well, for many different reasons, as you see listed on the screen right now, decreased stress levels, less risk of heart disease. It gives you a better emotional state, anti-aging benefits as well. Now, I have a milestone birthday coming up next year. I'm not going to tell you which one it is, but I am a big fan of anything that is anti-aging. It also helps promote better sleep. It relieves those aches and pains, which as you know, sometimes they just kind of creep up on you. Supports weight loss. All right, who doesn't like that? Improved blood flow and circulation as well. And then also the detox benefits healthier looking skin. Have any of you stepped up a carnival cruise and when you've seen your friends or your neighbors, they've said, there's something different about you. You've got that, that uh, you know, glow. Well, part of it is yes, the, the beautiful Caribbean weather, but part of it too is if you've enjoyed our spa, you're gonna have that healthier looking skin. And then of course, last but not least, increased happiness. Go ahead and sign me up for that, right? So, you know, when we talk about enjoying yourself in our spas on board, I just want to let all of you on today's call know that you and your clients deserve it. You know, everybody splurges on different things when they're vacationing, right? It really depends on personal preference, what matters most to you. Some really splurge when it comes to picking a stateroom. Sometimes it's on shore excursions or swimming with the dolphins. And then for some, it's booking spa appointments. I definitely love to splurge on my spa appointments. And, you know, if I had known last January um, that it would be over a year that I'd get to take a carnival cruise, you better believe I would have booked like four or five spa appointments versus just the one that I enjoyed. So, you enjoy it, your clients deserve it, and uh, you and your clients deserve it. So definitely go ahead, don't hold back, and we encourage you to, um, to enjoy our Cloud9 spas on board and all of our spas. So speaking of that, I do want to just let you know, we refer to our spas on board in two different ways. We have our spa carnival and our Cloud9 spa. The only difference is really size and amenities. So we have about a 50-50 mix. Half of our ships, uh, half of our fleet, 13 ships, have spa carnival. So that would be our fantasy class, conquest class, and spirit class ships. The rest of our ships in our fleet, 12, have the cloud nine spa. So these are going to be our larger, newer classes of ships, which are our dream class, vista class, sunshine class, Excel class, which is our Mardi Gras and soon to be Carnival Celebration, plus our Carnival Splendor. Now, if you're not familiar with what ships fall into each class, uh, this will be a plug for you to reach out to your local business development manager. And we actually have a cheat sheet for this. So feel free to reach out to us and we can definitely send you this guide. Now, what's the difference? As mentioned, it's really just size and amenities. On Spa Carnival, we have two saunas, one on the men's side, one on the women's, two steam rooms, one on men's, one on women's, and then of course plenty of treatment massage rooms for our European style treatments and services. Now in Cloud9 Spa, on our newest, largest classes of ships, we have a 20,000 square foot spa complex, ladies and gentlemen. So with that said, we've got room for more amenities. So we do have the two saunas, one on men's, one on women's side. And by the way, those saunas and the steam rooms and spa carnival, plus the saunas in Cl Cloud9 Spa, those are complimentary. So you don't have to pay anything extra to use those uh, facilities. We also have a relaxation room, which was pictured 
in that last image on the previous slide. So it's a beautiful room to just go in there. You can relax. There's some relaxing music that's piped in. We've got some chilled cucumber water for you to enjoy to really get your mind set right before and after your spa treatments. Then we have these fabulous thermal suites, which we're gonna talk about in a moment. Now there is a charge for the thermal suites, um, but uh, if you've booked a particular stateroom type, that actually comes complimentary with your room. So we'll talk a bit about that too. The Lasso Therapy Pools, which are available in Cloud9 Spa, on Vista class ships, instead of having a traditional Thalasso therapy pool, instead there's a very large hot tub spa. Experience showers. Um, if this is on Vista class and our Excel class. And if you've never experienced an experience shower, think of uh, probably the biggest shower you've ever been in. Uh, there are lights that change colors. There's relaxing music. There are multiple jets. Um, you know, I'd say at least half a dozen different water jets and you can change the pressure. It is just such an amazing experience. Every time I come home, I think about wanting to uh, add one of those <laughs> to my house one day. But for now, I'm just gonna enjoy them on Carnival. Uh, and then of course, our beautiful treatment rooms our Cloud9 spa uh, areas, they are actually large enough to where we have some VIP suites with your own private hot tub in your treatment room. How cool is that? So that's just that those are the subtle differences between the spa carnival and Cloud9 spa. Again, every single one of our ships has an amazing spa on board, no matter what we call it. So there are saunas on all of our ships as mentioned, every single one. And there's no additional charge to use the sauna. On some of our larger classes of ships, so our Conquest class and newer, we even have some spectacular views. Just take in that view, ladies and gentlemen. It's been a while since we've seen it. How relaxing is that? And then of course our treatment rooms are beautifully appointed. Uh, if you have, you know, not uh, done a lot of treatments on more carnival, just to let you know, there is something for everyone, both men and women, everyone on board deserves a wonderful spa treatment. And whether you enjoy hot stone massages, there are sweetest sweet dish massages, seaweed wraps, there are some detox wraps and treatments you can sign up for. My personal favorite is the lime and ginger salt scrub and massage. It is 90 minutes of the most relaxing experience of your life, ladies and gentlemen. Um, now, my tip would be do the lime and ginger salt scrub and massage early in your cruise before you spend too much time in the sun. And then you can book other treatments that don't involve a salt scrub later on during your trip. Um, and then, of course, couples massages as well. Now, keep in mind, with the couples massages, if you book one of those on a ship that has the Cloud9 Spa Complex, those couples massages oftentimes will be held in these VIP treatment rooms, which come appointed with your own private hot tub. Pretty neat, huh? And so here's an image of our Thalassotherapy pool, which, as you can see, this woman uh, and her, uh, her man there are enjoying. Now, the Thalassotherapy pools are available on all of our ships with the Cloud9 spas, with the exception of Vista class, which instead has a large hot tub spa. Thalassotherapy pools are like, they're like large hot tubs. They're filled with ionized water, and they have those great jets where if you position your back in the right spot, it's actually like a free massage. And then here's a picture of the thermal suites. So we have those thermal suites, which are dry heat and also wet heat chambers. Uh, this is an image of one of our dry heat chambers. And that is a lounge chair made out of tile that is heated. So it's a great place to just go uh, put on your Cloud9 spa robe and relax. And there is some very relaxing music that's piped in there too. And then here's an image of our thermal suites 
on our uh, newest ship to sail, our Mardi Gras, coming soon to Port Canaveral. So again, the thermal suites might look a little bit different on each ship that has Cloud9 Spa, but they are all just so amazing. So quick question for everyone. Are you feeling relaxed yet? Now, our spa staterooms, uh, one thing that I wanted to mention, every single ship that has a Cloud9 spa complex comes with spa staterooms. So what does that mean? That means if all of those wonderful thermal suites and the Lasso therapy pools sound like they're right up you and your client's alley, you're going to want to book a spa stateroom. Spa staterooms do go fast, so make sure your clients are booking early. They come in a variety of categories. So regardless of your budget, uh, there is something for you, whether it's an interior ocean view balcony or even spa suites that are available. The decor is slightly different. As you can see, it's beautiful, um, beautiful decor. And then of course, the best part are the extra amenities that you get. So um, again, as mentioned, spa stay rooms on all of our ships with Cloud9 spas. They come in a variety of categories from interior to suites. And when you book one of those state rooms, you do get those amenities, which includes priority spa appointments. You also get a cruise long pass to our thermal suites. So there's dry heat chambers, the steam chambers, which comes with the aromatherapy steam room, oriental steam room. We even have an aromatic grotto and a hammam cha chamber on some of our ships. Um, plus, of course, you get a cruise log pass to our thalassotherapy pool or large hot tub spa if you're on a Vista class. Experience showers, one of my favorites. Um, you get access to those. Plus, you get a complimentary scrub kit to use in our thermal suites. So you walk up to the spa um, and they uh, present you with the opportunity to actually create your own scrub kit. They're great. You can use them while you're cruising and then take the rest home with you as an extra souvenir. You also get complimentary pathway to yoga or pathway to Pilates fitness classes, complimentary body composition analysis, spa branded bathrobes and slippers, everybody, Elemis shampoo and gel soap, which smells incredible. And then one of the best parts about it are the discounts on the signature spa treatments. Anywhere from 10 to 30% off when you book uh, on a C day. And then anywhere from 20 to 40% off when you book on a day at port. Okay, so just keep that in mind for all of those great deals. Now, I don't know about you, Calvin, but I'm getting a little hungry. Yeah, Maria, I, I got to tell you, after this uh, workout uh, this morning uh, uh, and talking about our fitness center, our Sky Fitness, uh, and this amazing presentation on our Cloud9 Spa, uh, I am really hungry, folks. And let me tell you, before, before I get into some of the tips on and suggestions that we have on board our ships when it comes to healthy options for food, Maria, let me tell you, those spa state rooms are the best. Uh, we had the opportunity to sail on one of them. And as soon as you walk in the hallway of spa state rooms, the experience begins. And those state rooms are amazing. And when I came back from our ports of call, I would take advantage of those thermal suites uh, and those heated beds, let me tell you, are really cool. Uh, you just fall asleep on them and you forget the time. You wake up, you're like, whoa, what time is it? But it's a really, really uh, great experience. So uh, I recommend all your clients, travel advisors, to uh, make sure that they uh, book one of these spa staterooms and take advantage of this area. So let's dive into some healthy food options. And I've listed a bunch of them uh, for you. And I'll give you some of my uh, uh, preferences that I like when I'm aboard the ship, uh, and I'll give you one of the experiences that I do is uh, I'm a early bird uh, morning gym guy, and uh, I leave the wife and the kids sleeping in the stateroom, and I go work out in our fitness center. And so when I'm done, I like to go up to our Lido uh, marketplace and take advantage of some healthy food options for breakfast like our eggs, uh, scrambled eggs with tomato, 
Uh, we also have uh, hard, hard boiled eggs. Uh, but if you're looking for a fresh veggie omelet, we have those available ready to serve. Uh, those are a great option uh, for those folks looking uh, for something healthy in the morning. And if you need a little bit of a boost, um, you can also have oatmeal with nuts, fruit, or cottage cheese, or even a toast. Uh, we also have fruit on board, uh, and some great options are grapefruit, bananas, and watermelon, uh, yogurt, and peanut butter, and why not have some bacon? Yes, I know Maria wanted to spike her pina colada while I wanted to spike my breakfast with some bacon. So I got to have some bacon with my eggs uh, to make it a little bit more fun. And all of these are great options that you can find on our Lido Marketplace. Uh, you can also enjoy our Sea Day Brunch, uh, which is available with some really great uh, healthy options as well. But now we've made it to our lunchtime. And with some of our ships, you can find our Fresh Creations, which is a salad version of an all-you-can-eat buffet fill up your plate with all the greens and everything that you want to put on your salads uh, to make it fun uh, and exciting for you for, for lunch. Um, and on some of the ships that we have our seafood shack, we offer some really lighter seafood options that are available there at an extra charge. Uh, but uh, also on our Lido deck, you can have a veggie stir fry at our Mongolian walk station. Wow, that is amazing. I love visiting our Mongolian walk station because it's fresh. You pick out what you like and uh, they make it there in front of you, in front of it for you. So really, really cool. And you can also go to our deli uh, for a sandwich uh, that you can have as well. But you cannot forget of our Blue Iguana Cantina. Now, I have this for breakfast and lunch because those breakfast burritos are amazing. But if you're also looking for another healthy option, you can do a veggie burrito, which are also very good. And I'm going to give you guys a little insight tip. So we cannot forget about our friend Guy Fieri and his amazing uh, burgers at our burger joint. You cannot forget about those. And here's the tip. But before I give you the tip, I'm going to give you a little story behind Guy Fieri and his amazing burgers. So I went on a cruise when we first uh, had our partnership with Guy and we sailed the family and my, my son, you know, we all went together. We came back. No big deal. When we went to book our cruise, the next sign, my son goes to me, Dad, if there's not Guy's burger joint on this ship, we are not sailing. So. Going back to the healthy food option is that if you want to have a guy's burger, just ask them to give you no bread and there's your tip. So now when we go to dinner, now in dinner we have our Lido Marketplace with, which offers many food options, our, our healthy options, our main dining room. You can take advantage of salmon, chicken, steak, uh, we have uh, low sodium, low carb, low fat options as well, but we cannot forget dessert. Yes, yes, we can have dessert. It's okay. And we do offer great healthy options like fresh fruit, the cheese platters, sugar-free pies, and sugar-free ice cream because you can't go wrong on your vacation and have a little bit of dessert. So Maria, I think that you told me you have a little bit of a dessert that you really like. <laughs> I did tell you. So um, I just want to share with all of you one of my personal favorite healthy desserts that we serve up on Carnival Ships, ladies and gentlemen. Our Carnival Warm Melting Chocolate Cake, of course. Now, you know, you may be saying, well, I don't know if I'd put this in the category of healthy dessert options. You're probably right. But you know what? This definitely is in uh, the, the top place when it comes to deliciousness. So I'm sure most of you travel advisors that are on the call today, this is probably one of your favorite treats 
personally, it is my absolute favorite dessert that we serve on board. So you know what? I will tell you the same thing that I say about our spa treatments. You and your clients deserve it. And when you're sailing on Carnival, you and your clients deserve our Carnival Warm Chocolate Melting Cake as well. Now, I have cruised before and I have, I have ordered the um, Carnival, uh, Warm Carnival Chocolate Melting Cake every single evening. And then on some of my cruises where I'm a little bit more mindful, I will sometimes mix things up. And maybe for a couple of nights, I'll order up one of our lower cal, lower sugar desserts, which are great too. Um, or maybe the, our cheese platter. If you haven't tried our cheese platter before, I encourage you to do so. It's delicious. Um, but again, nothing compares to our carnival warm chocolate melting cake. Uh, there is just nothing that's quite the same. So again, it's all about balance. And, uh, you know, on those cruises that I do enjoy this every evening, I just make sure to um, do a couple extra laps on the sports deck. Maria, Maria, please, please, please tell our travel advisors the truth. You know that when you have your melting lava cake, you don't just have one for one seating. I think that you have maybe two or three, or maybe up to five on that one seating. So that way you can take advantage of saying, well, I had my melting lava cake for the cruise and I'm good for the rest of the cruise. So travel advisors, please, Maria will sit down and have a couple of those just so she feels good. But they you are- You know all my secrets, Calvin. Oh yeah, Maria, you know it, you know it. But uh, ladies and gentlemen, let me tell you this warm uh, lava cake is amazing. I'll give you guys an inside tip that one of our travel uh, partners gave me on one of the fam trips, which was, if you like peanut butter and you're a peanut butter fan, put peanut butter in that melting lava cake and mix it up. It tastes like a Reese's Pieces a buttercup. So it is really good. So make sure you're on that jogging track, uh, burning those calories so you can take advantage of that amazing dessert that we offer our famous melting lava cake. So let's now dive into our dietary needs. Uh, and this is very important. And I recommend all of you to make sure that you're asking these uh, important questions uh, to your clients when you're, when you're booking their vacations. And uh, it's always good to know uh, this in advance and that you let uh, us know as well uh, if there's any dietary needs that your clients uh, need to have one on board. Now, here are some of the examples that we provide our guests. Uh, we have vegetarian dishes, low uh, cholesterol, low fat, low carb, low sugar, gluten-free uh, options as well. Uh, we can also provide guests with gluten-free options with our pizza dough, our pasta, our bread, and our deli sandwiches or uh, hamburger buns, uh, even cakes, uh, frozen desserts, yogurt, you know, and, and so on. Uh, the important thing that, it, it, that you all need to make sure that you advise your clients is that you let them know that it's important that they speak to the head waiter uh, on, uh, in the dining room in advance so that way we know if there's anything uh, in particular that we need to do on our end to make sure that your clients uh, are um, able to, to, you know, make sure that they have their dietary needs uh, uh, taken care of. Now, the other thing that we do offer and we do need uh, two weeks advance notice is that we offer kosher meals and Indian uh, vegetarian meals as well. Uh, so make sure you let us know in advance uh, so that way we can make sure that these meals are delivered uh, to our ships and that way your clients have them on board. The other thing that's uh, is important is any food allergies. Uh, you know, let your clients uh, it, to, uh, make sure that they inform us and our team on board. Uh, again, uh, these accommodations are, can only be made in our main dining rooms. Uh, they can speak to their head waiter uh, once they arrive and make sure uh, to let them know if they have any food allergies um, that they need to or that they need to let us know so that way we make sure that uh, they're safe uh, while they're eating and, and uh, we're taking care of their dietary needs. Now, 
in all of our uh, dining rooms, we have this really unique uh, menu, which is our American Table and American Feast uh, menus. And these are great options um, that we provide our guests. Uh, with the American Table menu, you know, it's just a few examples here that are listed are shrimp cocktail, veggie spring rolls, uh, seared tilapia, uh, veal parmesan, you know, are just a few of the many healthy options uh, that we have for your clients. And then in our American Feast menu, and I've taken advantage of this one a lot, uh, but on our six plus, uh, you know, you can find our boiled uh, main lobster tail. And I, a little secret from me, you know, I gave you the little secret from Maria. My secret is I order three to four of those. I love it. Uh, it comes with our mashed potatoes and our grilled shrimp, and it is totally amazing. Um, for cruises that are fiber or less, you won't see the lobster. However, we do have some other healthy options with uh, mushroom cream soup, uh, baby spinach for appetizers, seared bass. Um, and I really, I, I'll be honest with you all, is uh, I've, I really truly like that flat iron steak that we have from the grill. Uh, it's really good, it's healthy. Uh, we have pork chops, chicken breast. So we have so many options available. And if your clients are looking for those steakhouse selections, we also have that available uh, for them if they wanna have those steakhouse selections in the dining room. That all sounds so great, Calvin. Now I'm definitely hungry. Um, so we've talked a lot about staying active on board, mind, body, wellness, and enjoying our spas. Calvin shared, uh, and I guess I shared, some healthy uh, eating options uh, in our dining rooms. But now I just want to mention the importance of staying hydrated while you're on board. You know, most of our cruises travel to the Caribbean, Bahamas, so these are warm weather destinations. So you're out in the sun all day, you're drinking those fruity beverages, and it's really important to stay mindful and to stay hydrated through your trip. So um, my recommendation to you and for your clients is to go ahead and suggest that they order bottled waters to be delivered to their stateroom. This is super simple. This can be set up through our fun shops. Um, so you can access this through your uh, cruise manager section. So the same area where you would go to, you know, maybe buy um, also some shore excursions and things like that. You can also purchase bottled waters so that once you get to your stateroom, you've checked into your cruise, your waters are there waiting for you. Also, we don't talk a lot about the non-alcoholic options that are available with Cheers, but just so that you know, the non-alcoholic options available when you purchase Cheers are unlimited. So you can get as many of these non-alcoholic beverages as you like on your cruise if you have the Cheers package. So these would be things like our bottled waters. Also, we have some delicious sparkling flavored water by Bubbly. We have Bubbly Lime and Bubbly Grapefruit and Orange flavor. We've got some teas. We have diet and zero sugar sodas as well. Also some sports drinks, both Gatorade and Propel energy drinks. We have smoothies, both the alcoholic and non-alcoholic kinds. And of course, fresh juices and specialty coffees and teas. Now, all of those are included with your um, Cheers package if you've purchased that. Now, um, there are some other beverages for purchase that are not available with your Cheers, but you can buy them separately, which are Naked Green Machine drinks, they come in Mighty Mango, uh, a Green Machine flavor, and Strawberry Banana flavor, which are all delicious. And then if you're like Calvin and you spend a lot of time pumping iron in the gym, uh, you may want to also uh, tell your clients about the Muscle Milk Protein Shakes. So we have those in vanilla and also Knockout Chocolate flavor. So, you know, one quick tip I'll share with you before we wrap up today's presentation is, you know, and I learned this in the beginning when I first started cruising, is I could eat a whole, uh, a whole lot more carnival warm chocolate melting cakes and a lot more pizza at three o'clock in the morning when I take the stairs versus the elevator. So that's just one tip. Again, I find it helpful. I can enjoy our delicious carnival cuisine even that much more when I burn some calories by taking the stairs 
versus the elevators when I'm cruising. And what about you, Calvin? What's your secret? Bueno, María, te tengo que decir que estamos aquí en Havana Bar, pero podemos bailar toda la noche aquí con eh, haciendo un poco de cardio porque bailando es parte del movimiento del cuerpo y de verdad lo podemos disfrutar. And ladies and gentlemen, don't worry, I'm going to translate this all for you all. And it's basically that we're here in Havana Bar, but not only in Havana Bar can you dance the night away and exercise all the way through the night, but not only that, but we have our clubs, we have our uh, other areas um, in Plaza where you can really take advantage and dance the night away exercising. Yes, dancing is exercising. So that way you guys can have so much fun when you're on your cruise, dancing and listening to some great live music. You got it, Calvin. And I have to say that dancing, whether it's in our Havana bar to some salsa or merengue or bachata music, or maybe just dancing to the Cupid Shuffle out on Lido deck, those are my favorite ways to burn some serious calories when I'm cruising. So I totally agree with you. And then of course, we can't forget, take in your vitamin C, everyone. You know, we've been talking a lot about the importance this past year about getting out, getting some fresh air, staying active, and just enjoying the sunshine. So there's not a better place, in my opinion, than out there on our Lido deck, everyone. Whether you are doing laps in the pool or whether you are lounging with a pina colada in hand, you know you're focusing on your mind body wellness when you're cruising with Cordoval. So I just want to thank all of you uh, on behalf of myself, Mr. Calvin Rodriguez, your entire family here at Carnival Cruise Line. We just want to thank you for everything that you have done through this past year, everything that you're currently doing. We really appreciate all of your efforts and we thank you for coming to today's Tune In Tuesday and joining us. So uh, we just want to tell you to stay well, stay active, have fun, and we can't wait to see you on board the next Carnival Cruise. So ciao everyone and don't forget, travel agents rock.